Well, the point of the, of the game is that you can, uh, of course, uh, travel all surfaces, so you can uh, run over both sur surfaces. Most of the uh, most of the passes are mechanical based, so uh, so this uh, this is a wheel, but it, it isn't turning now, so uh, so I, of course I have to activate it. Something like this. And then the ropes are like uh, like stuff from uh, from the real world. Uh, Put up into uh, onto higher grounds and a bit uh, fragmented. So and of course uh, I can pick stuff up and kick it around uh, and use it, use it as uh, so now we have weight on, on one side of the t uh, of the seat and then. Uh, and then that would, uh, would change the outcome of uh, okay. how the sequel works. So you can use the physics to, to solve some puzzles, and some are more logical where you have to use switches and, uh, and stuff to activate things. And you can, uh, yeah, you have to pick up stuff. Right now there's break hands. Maybe they won't miss break hands in uh, two months. <laughs> so uh, we don't know yet. Basically, the levels are inspired by different uh, different cities. So this one is inspired by Paris, and the metro train, and uh, okay. stuff like that. So that's part of the reason why it's called European Europa, and uh, the character is a European. Yeah. So it takes place about different different cities and yeah. big guys. And the the one siders live, and they're they're quite mean. And the, they don't like the, the small guy, which is. Uh, you play, so they'll hunt you and they'll try to punch yeah. you off the platforms. Very aggressive. Yeah, he's really aggressive, so he'll punch you. Oh. Most of the time you'll fly off the platform, but you can get lucky sometimes and uh, yeah. land somewhere. So basically, to get rid of him, you have to kick him. Yeah, I'll smart him. Uh, or uh, sometimes you can, you can trick him onto running off the platforms, but that's mostly because uh, the AI is a little bit broken right now. You can use stuff to get his attention, so you can, uh, you can uh, pick up stuff and throw it at him. So if you kick him in the front, he'll just slow down. But if you kick him from the from the behind, he'll uh, he'll run off the platform. So that's, uh, that's uh, there are some more characters which are not shown yet, which uh, which you can actually use as weapons against. The other guys as well. Okay. So. Yeah. So, but, but the basic uh, basic thing in the game is that you have to, to solve puzzles to reach the goal. You have to get rid of the big guys as well. So it's a classic platform game, really, with a with a few uh, few twists. Yeah. The graphics looks nice. Thank you. <laughs> what will the sound be uh, be like? Uh, it'll be obviously there'll be sound effects, of course. Yeah. Okay. And then we want to use, uh, use different uh, different different bands. We haven't we haven't completely decided on whether what kind of it's not going to be orchestral music or stuff like that, but more like uh, modern rock or hip hop or something okay. like that. So uh, it'll it'll fit in with the. The, environment. the urban environment, really, and some of the, the music is actually environmental as well. We have like small ghetto blasters which plays the music, so you can pick them up and carry them along. Okay. So, but we're not showing this right now because it's a little, it's a little too early to show that. And there's so much noise here anyway. So yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's a 
principle of it. Uh -oh. So it yeah. looks uh, fun to play. Yes, it's a classic platform formula. So yeah, hopefully, if you like platform games, you'll like this one. The game will be for all ages, or yeah, we haven't. Uh, we don't have any restrictions as such. I mean, the character is it's quite cute. Yeah. So he should appeal to even uh, quite quite young people. And uh, I mean, there's not blood or uh, yeah. explosions or anything like that that can scare people. Maybe the big guy can be a little bit scary, but so yeah. And I think the environments appeal to uh, appeal to most people as well. So. It's not like we're targeting a male from 15 to 16 or something like that. We're, we're trying to get as, as, as broad as we can. And basically, we're just doing what we like. So, if we like it, we hope other people will like it as well. Will the game uh, also be uh, on PC or...? Uh, right now it's running on PC, it's just... Yeah, oh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just an Xbox controller, oh, okay. yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so we're not decided on the final platform yet. It depends on if we get any publisher or what's going to happen. So okay. Maybe someone wants it on something specific, and we don't know that yet. I see that the game is better played with a with a controller than than the keyboard. Than the keyboard. Yeah. It's actually quite uh, quite comfortable to control with the keyboard as well. Okay. So you just use the arrow keys and then you have like a few buttons to either jump and pick up and stuff. But actually, I don't know when we're when we're developing it and testing it. Half the time I'm using the keyboard because it's. I mean, I'm, I'm coding the stuff, so yeah, okay. I have to play something. You actually rotate the camera with this uh, both sides, and when uh, when you push forward, it will automatically change the pause that way. So even for people that are not that used to playing games, it's it's easier than using yeah, two okay. joysticks to control Much the more camera. more accessible for other players too. Yeah, exactly, and for for kids as well. So, yeah, we hope anyway. Yeah. <laughs> this is uh, another example of a uh, environmental puzzle. Uh, um, we have a switch that's actually activated uh, in the beginning, but when, uh, when you remove the activation object, uh, well, in this case, it's a, it's a doll that opens. Very nice game. And here you need to, uh, to put objects into pipes to actually get them to the right level. Use them down here. <laughs> so you see the pistons are coming out, so so I can travel to uh, to go there. Yeah. Nice puzzles. <laughs> so that's uh, pretty much it yeah. uh, for now. The, the last one is the basic level, so it actually goes uh, through all the, the different uh, the different things that, that I showed. Okay.